You've probably heard the saying, life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Some people feel that way about starting a new job, too, wondering just what lies ahead. Hi, we're here to guide you through a video orientation of CSX Transportation so that you'll have a better idea about what you can expect from the company and what the company will expect of you. Let's start with a short video that will give you an overview of the company. Corporation, the company that puts things in motion. CSX is one of the nation's largest railroads and more. We're Sealand, with container ships calling on 120 ports around the world. We're CSX Intermodal, the nation's only full-service coast-to-coast intermodal transportation company. We're American Commercial Lines, a leader in barge transportation on both U.S. and foreign waterways. And we're CTI, Customized Transportation Incorporated, a fast-growing provider of contract logistics services. CSX transportation companies work together, sharing market intelligence, focusing on the strengths of each other, and taking advantage of the synergies possible with transportation services that complement each other. Clearly, CSX is a company on the move, on the world stage, and offering a vast array of transportation capabilities. Our company was formed 15 years ago when the Chessie System and Seaboard Coastline Railroads came together. That created what is today a 19,000 route mile network stretching from Canada to Florida. But CSX goes back even further. More than 165 years, the Baltimore and Ohio Railroad, the nation's first common carrier, is the oldest ancestor of CSX. Those founding fathers knew early on, without wheels, you weren't going anywhere. And today, you're not going anywhere without technology. Competition requires a keen edge, strength, and conditioning. No less is required in the competitive arena of transportation. Our competitive edge is technology, for and about people. Our Advanced Information Technology Center in Jacksonville touches everything we do. How else could we manage this vast company? Computers kick in from the call to assemble a train crew to the dispatching of that train. Our computer systems touch our customers, too. Those systems allow customers to monitor their freight minute by minute using PCs in their own offices. Our operations center in Jacksonville controls the movement of 1,300 trains a day. Dispatchers can see every mile of track on giant panoramic screens. At the customer service center, a shipper's profile pops up on a computer screen as soon as a call is received, and customer service reps verify cars by calling up digital images. Another breakthrough is in locomotive power. A new generation of locomotives is powered by alternating current, the biggest motive power innovation since diesel-electric locomotives came into play in the 1930s. These AC units can pull harder than traditional direct current models, and each one can replace two of our older units. Yet all the technology, all the transportation know-how in the world, none of it matters if you don't work safely. CSX Transportation is one of the safest railroads in the industry. Reportable injuries and train accidents are both down substantially. Our progress in safety saves lives and increases reliability. CSX, it's people who put things in motion. Competitive people using technology. Competitive people serving customers. We've got a vast range of talent and expertise that makes our company special. The heart and soul of any company is its people, and CSX people have an attitude that they can be the best.
you'll be working for CSX Transportation, a company rich in history and on the leading edge of change. Its approximately 29,000 employees work towards safety, quality, and reliable service every day. Let's take a look now at the information in the packet that you received in the mail along with this video. The annual report, history booklet, fact book, corporate structure sheet and system map inside your packet can give you even more information about your new railroad family. You're joining a team with a mission. The CSX mission statement reads, we are committed to being a leader in railroad, inland water, and containerized distribution markets. CSX works towards that goal by supporting three major constituencies. For our customers, we work as a partner to provide excellent service by meeting all agreed upon commitments. CSXT sells service. That's our business. If we tell a customer that a car will reach them in three days, we have to commit to getting that car there on time. CSX also supports its employees. CSX creates a work environment that motivates and allows its employees to grow and develop and perform their jobs to the maximum of their capacity. You will find opportunities to develop your talents and grow with the company. CSX shareholders are also very important. The company works to meet its goals in order to provide shareholders with sustainable superior returns. CSX is well positioned to stride into the 21st century and Wall Street has recognized that. Hand in hand, all employees, whether they are in the field running trains or sitting behind an executive desk, are railroad professionals and should be committed to teamwork, quality, empowerment and accountability, ethical conduct, change, and a sense of urgency to get the job done right. Turn over your mission and value statement and you'll find the criteria for success at CSX. The corporation believes that the company's success is tied to your individual success. Every employee is expected to serve our customers, support the mission, personally practice the CSX values, gain knowledge about the railroad industry, and value the company assets. Those By the way, there's a probationary period at CSXT that lasts 90 days. Under guidelines of the labor contract, you can be terminated for any reason during that time. This introduction wouldn't be complete without taking a look at the training program you're getting ready to begin. The following short video takes you through that program from start to finish. Then we'll be back with a few quick reminders. Welcome to the Trainman and Conductor New Hire Training Program. Over the next several weeks, you will learn what it takes to become a railroader at CSX Transportation. Because safety is number one here at CSXT, your training will focus heavily on safe work practices and operating rules. Your 16-week training session is divided into five phases. During phase one, you spend time in orientation at one of CSXT's locomotive engineer and conductor training facilities in either Atlanta, Georgia or Cumberland, Maryland. During this orientation, you will be given general information about CSXT, what we require of you as an employee and what you can expect from us. Once you complete orientation, you will have a general understanding of the railroad lifestyle and CSX transportation. From here, you begin formalized trainman classroom training. During this part of your training, you spend two weeks learning what a trainman does through instruction in both a classroom environment and at a hands-on training facility nearby. At the car shop classroom, your instructors will orient you on the basics of safety, track components, and standard operating procedures. There, you will also learn how CSXT communicates through hand signals, computer printouts, and radio transmissions. During this phase of training, you also will learn how to perform inspections, how to throw switches, and how to change air hoses. While in trainman classroom training, you'll be tested daily so we know which areas you're mastering and where you need further assistance. Each Friday, you'll be given a cumulative exam which covers everything learned to date. 
On your last day of trainman classroom training, you face a final exam. A score of 85% is required to pass this phase of training and graduate to the next phase. Because safety is such a crucial part of your job, you must also pass a 50-question operating rules test with a score of at least 90%. If you are unable to achieve the passing scores established for those exams, but you score at least a 70%, you will be placed on probation and retested. However, if your score is under 70% on these exams, you will fail the training program and your employment with CSXT will terminate at this time. However, we expect all of you to pass the written examinations and move on to the Trainman Apprenticeship. During your Trainman Apprenticeship, your training moves outside the classroom to your home terminal. During the next four weeks, you will receive hands-on experience as a Trainman as you learn about the physical plant characteristics of your assigned territory. At the conclusion of this six-week combination of classroom and on-the-job training, you will be qualified as a trainman and ready to begin either conductor or locomotive engineer training. If your path leads to conductor training, you will once again move inside the classroom. During this phase of instruction, you will learn about restricted equipment, proper training building techniques, how to inspect a train, and advanced information about train movement. You will be tested daily on what you have learned with a comprehensive test each Friday covering all materials presented to date. Scores will be evaluated to identify any trainees requiring assistance. In order to stay in the conductor training program, you must pass your final exam with a score of at least 85%, a 100 question operating rules exam by a score of 90%, and you must attain a perfect score, 100%, on your signals test. Once you pass your final exams inside the classroom, you are ready again for the outdoors. Training moves to your home terminal for the conductor apprenticeship. This final phase of training includes approximately eight weeks of conductor-specific instruction designed to provide you with information about yard and road jobs, through freights, local and road switchers, and hostler positions. Sound complicated? Well, it might right now. But remember, this course was designed for you by experienced conductors who once stood in your shoes. They know the challenges you face in your training and have designed this program for you. Believe us when we say, by the end of this 16-week training, you will sound and act like a true railroader. And you will have people all around you who are there to help. During your conductor apprenticeship, conductor trainers from your home terminal will be there to guide you on the various tasks a conductor must perform. Your training will be divided into three steps. First, you spend a day observing your conductor trainer and completing a job profile. A job profile is your own notes about your customers, such as the layout of the track, the direction of switches, and any other pertinent information that will help you serve your customers. After your first day in observation, you spend the next day working the job with the conductor trainer. And then you spend day three actually running the job with guidance from your trainer as required. The testing for this phase of training will be based on observations by your local sponsor. Results of this informal testing will go into your training file. Prior to starting work on the railroad, you will be once again tested. There are three tests in the Advancement to Conductor exam. You must score at least 85% on a general information test, at least 90% on an operating rules test, and at least 85% on a physical characteristics test of your home territory. This last test will be graded by your field sponsor. If you do not receive passing scores, but still score 70% or more, you will be allowed to take the tests again between 10 and 30 days of your original test date. If you fail to make the required scores on the advancement to conduct your exam after the second testing, your employment with CSXT will end. At some point, you may be selected to take part in locomotive engineer training instead of conductor training. If that occurs, your instruction will vary slightly. After you complete trainman classroom training and your on-the-job apprenticeship, 
you spend five weeks inside the classroom in Cumberland, Maryland, learning what a locomotive engineer does. During the first week, you will learn the mechanical components of a locomotive. The second week, you learn how to perform brake tests. Week three teaches proper train handling techniques. During week four, you learn operating rules of the railroad. And in week five, you face your final exams for your locomotive engineer classroom training. To complete this phase of training, you must pass a signals test by a perfect score of 100%, a mechanical components test by a score of 80%, and an operating rules test by a score of 85%. Once you complete engineer classroom training, you are ready for the outdoors during 21 weeks of locomotive engineer on-the-job training. During this hands-on instruction, you will learn the physical characteristics of your assigned territories and you will apply your knowledge of signals, train handling techniques, and operating rules to the important job of running a train. At the end of this five months of training, you will be tested again so we can learn your knowledge of your future job as a locomotive engineer. You'll be tested again on your operating rules, and this time you must pass the test with a score of 90%. You must also pass a locomotive operations and train handling exam, or LOTH test, by a score of 85%. And you must score an 80% on your qualifying trip with your sponsor, the road foreman of engines in your territory. Once you have passed each of these phases in your track of instruction, you will graduate to either conductor or locomotive engineer, and you'll join the proud CSXT family of railroaders who can say, we work for the best railroad in North America. That just about wraps up your video orientation. Here's three quick reminders. Number one, make sure you complete the PA4 form included in your packet. Then, bring it to class with you. Number two, mail your Code of Ethics receipt verification card. And number three, fill out the orange emergency contact information card. Then remember to bring the card with you when you come to class. You have the opportunity to grow with CSX Transportation and your railroad family will be there to help you all the way. We've given you a lot of information. If you have any questions, call your employee relations representative. Their names and phone numbers are provided on an information sheet in your packet. Good luck as you start your career with CSX Transportation. We'll look forward to seeing you on the railroad.